here I am with Michael Aquila, last year one of our top fighters from MMA Futures. Um, we still got to get you that plaque. <laughs> um, you know, man, we look forward to seeing you go out there tomorrow night, um, fighting against a game wrestler. Um, you know, how are you going to show the audience and show this guy that you're not so one-dimensional just going after that heel hook? Well, I mean, you know, I don't think I'm one-dimensional, but definitely when it comes to the fight, uh, my goal is always to win the fight as fast and efficiently as possible. I've had two fights in the amateur level where I didn't take a single strike, and that's always my goal. You know, with Ryan Hall doing what he did last weekend, that's always my same game plan is go out there, submit my opponent without taking any strikes. So I still look to do that. Right. You know what? I understand that, man. Take, take as little damage as you can. And we look forward to seeing it, man. Um, we haven't seen you in the cage in a little while. I mean, I think last time was over the summer in, in, the, uh, in the ball field ones. No, before that. Before that? Okay, okay. That's when we gave you your award. Um, um, you know, why the time off? Are you looking at uh, doing some other things? Are you finding an injury? You know, why the time off? Uh, I was offered a fight uh, for that, that ball yard brawl card. Uh, I was injured, so I wasn't able to do that fight. And then just nothing came together after that. You know, I've been healthy training this whole time. Even during that injury period, I was still in the gym training. I just wasn't quite in fight condition to get out there. Uh, but, you know, I'm always working. I'm training 15 times a week. I'm always doing stuff. I never take time off. I'm teaching jiu-jitsu, I'm coaching, I'm training, I'm fighting, I'm, I'm working all my skill sets. I wrestle, I box, I kickbox, I do it all. So, you know, I'm, I'm ready to get in there. And wherever the fight goes, I'm ready to take it. So. Right, man, let's look into the brass tags. Who's your opponent, and how do you feel you match up against him when it comes right down to it? Sure, my opponent, Jared Talent, he's a, a normal 45er. Uh, like my last opponent, Jose Hernandez, was a 45er as well. Uh, most of these 35ers can't can't match up with me, so they got to get guys outside the division. He's a strong wrestler, strong top guy. He's got big power on his feet. You know, so I'll be using my footwork, keeping my distance, uh, looking to grapple and, and make it happen once I get my hands on him. Ron right, Manuel, hey, you know what? You're always exciting to watch. You always make it interesting, make it quick for the most part. Um, we look forward to seeing you tomorrow night live on Fight TV.